forbidden. Let my daughter go right now! She's a thief, Hellspawn. And you will wait for Korga's judgment. Now get back! Oh, let me through, Radrashev, or I'll rip your damn throat out! <laughs> Taken those guards. I'd rather you not get eaten by a bear. I could try grease some palms. These things over. Oh, because that went so well last time. We need to get Arabella out now. You heard the guards. They're waiting on Corker to give word. I'd sooner trek through the Nine Hells than trust that snake! Ugh. Arabella tried to steal their idol. Druids lost their damn minds about it. They need it for their precious ritual. Oh, it's all my fault. I told her I wished the wretched thing would just disappear, or better yet, explode. Now Arabella's being judged by a bunch of druids who hate us. That's not right. This grove is like a cauldron about to boil over. I say we check in on the child, make sure she comes to no harm. Thank you. They won't give us the time of day. Hurry! I'm at the end of my tether as is. Can't take this waiting. Gods, she must be terrified. I bet she's giving them hell. She's not our kid for nothing. Do all the damn rituals you want. We're not leaving till it's safe. We could help each other fight the goblins together. Instead, these fools are trying to chase us away. Lives are at stake, and the cowards only care about their bloody rituals. Those dirt kissers would let us die for the sake of their bloody grove. I'd like to keep our guts on the inside. <laughs> Carl Magrin, give her a chance. You, step back. Go join the other tieflings. A moment, Giona. What? Oh, I understand. You! Apparently Korga wants to see you. Go ahead. Few outsiders are allowed in here. Be respectful and do not interfere. Release her. She stole the idol of Sylvanus. 
She must pay the price. We will imprison the thief under guard of my serpent. When we cast out the rest, she may join them. Sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil, and I will cast out the rest. She's a parasite. She eats our food drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Tila is restless. Come, Korga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. The child's in danger. Do something, I beg you. I hear the Tree Father's spirit in your words. It is as you say. Sivasif! Tila to me! Out, thief! My grace has its limits. Thank you, Korga. Master Halsin would. Halsin isn't here! Keep his name off your tongue, lest Tila pierce it! That woman has more venom in her heart than a snake in its fangs. But at least the child is safe. What is youth if not a time to be forgiven for one's transgressions? A devil child. One who tries to steal from us. Couldn't agree more. The girl wasn't innocent, but that doesn't mean she was guilty. me like that again and I'll feed you to a knoll. Mom, I'm fine. Stop it. Our little hellion told us what happened. Thank you. Don't know what we'd do without her. It's not much, but here. Know that if you call, we'll come running, no matter what. Yeah. I mean, thank you for helping me. We have to look after ourselves. That's what Mole says. That girl. Ugh. I'm never gonna hear the end of this. If I'd got that stupid idol, I'd be a hero. Ugh. 
heroic thief. Mum? Dad, Mole? They all would have been so impressed. Mole said we had to do something, because the old folks weren't doing anything. They were talking when the druids were getting ready to throw us out. Why can't we just stay in until it's safe? Stop. The road to Baldur's Gate looks a little less daunting now that we're all back together. Stealing the idol. What were you thinking? Because of you, I got my little girl back. That's not something I'll forget. It's our job to get us out of here safely, not yours. It's my job too. The druids don't care about us. No one does. We have to look after ourselves. That's what Mole says. That girl. I don't care what Mole says. That was stupid and reckless. Stop. I was fine. Your mother was a heartbeat away from fighting a bear. Isn't that how Mum usually is? Quiet, you pup. Show some dignity and leave. You've burdened this place with your troubles long enough. See to your business here quickly, then leave. By Sylvanus, the old oak, all death begets life. You did well to speak up for the girl. That snake is fickle. A tragedy prevented. Well seen, well spotted. We've let a snake replace our leader. She is first druid in Horson's absence. With him caught or dead by goblins, none may gainsay her. But more will die if her ritual is finished. I doubt those exiled by the right will survive long outside. Would you? I would give anything to see Horson return home. Sylvanus's blessing upon you, and my gratitude as well. Hulsin is an elf with the presence of a bear. He left west with the adventurers. You won't mistake the first druid for anyone else. Come, boy. It's all right. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
please leave. Our hospitality has limits, and they were crossed long ago. What will you people want next? Letting the hell child go was a mistake. Go on. Say it. You think I'm a monster? Monster? <laughs> Too kind. A demon, more like. Yes, you would say so. I know you're kind. You see only villains and victims. A viper bears her fangs defending her brood. I call her mother. You call her monster. No matter. I took back the idol of Sylvanus, and the rite has resumed. We will seal the grove, free from harm, free of intruders. I don't want blood on my hands. We have the right to defend our home. So that's what you want, to kill a bunch of innocents? And mine perish if he stays. You showed great metal at the gate, the metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to Zevlor. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the Grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the Viper must strike. You will do more than speak. This tale ends but one way, with the Outlander rot cleansed, and the grove forever shrouded. Ridiculous. We just let her run off. She's a child. A devil child. One who tried to steal from us. Yet she failed. That's what matters. The wolf's fur bristles. He wants to jump, wants to bite. A low growl builds in his throat as his eyes track the movement of your tail. It's agitating him. His ears twitch as you speak, but his eyes don't shift from your tail. He sees you as a threat. It will all be over. The ritual's almost finished. Nateria knows the rites. We've shown them once. We take Grove Law seriously. By letting that child escape without consequence. We might as well have lain on the ground In and darkest let... hour, a concord made, twixt harp and wild against the shade. Harp and wild. You recall stories of an alliance between druids and the harpers, but the details are vague. The tower seized, the battle done. The moonrise broke the darkest one. History or myth, whatever is depicted here is long past. By claw and tooth, from root to thorn, 
the old oak's grove to wildlings sworn. The mural depicts a ritual, but you do not recognize the deity involved. forest rose with claw and tooth to tear the darkness from its roots. The mural depicts druid and beast fighting together to drive monsters from their land. It looks like they were victorious, and yet the monsters have returned. By letting that child escape without consequence. We might as well have lain on the ground and let them trample us. 